Right, picking it right up where we left off, we'll go straight into the next one. The arena run isn't going fantastic yet, but... We, you know, we've got to hope for the best here. Uh, one victory versus something. I don't even remember what I beat now. What did I beat the first time around? I beat something. It's not important, whatever it was. Uh, it wasn't a shaman. It was... I don't know what it was. What was it? it must... Oh, it was a warlock. Right, yeah. Warlock. I beat a warlock straight away. Uh, first game warlock. Uh, very close. Good game. Uh, second game priest. Relatively close game, but again... They priested their way to victory. Again, I'm probably gonna like slam priest constantly while I'm while I'm playing. I just can't stand people playing priest constantly at the moment. I just can't do do it. It just annoys me. Yeah. It's also it's also infuriating watching watching rogues play as well because you know I'm a rogue player. Yeah, very infuriating seeing a rogue do rogue things. I wanted a rogue. Why are you so lucky? Oh, never mind. Maybe I should have gone with a shaman. I'm a bit more experienced. No, not. It, it was. It was a. You know, a close call, really. The same turn as the cast, they get plus one one. Okay then. And we get. Well, I didn't go first, did I? Okay then. Um, we'll have one of these. One of these. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Uh, summon raid leader next turn, uh, provided they they can't kill him without an additional card, unless she uses her daggers, which she can easily do to take down my taunt. It's not going to do any damage to her either, so I don't see why she wouldn't. It's so not. Many it's not really options. a waste either. That's what I would do. You know, you'd pop in your pop in the dagger, hit with the two minions, slam it into the guy. I pretty much just showed her what to do there by Avner, because it's going to light up on her screen saying I'm print, like hovering over it. Oh dear. But, oh he. A, a Jantus. He, she. Person. Ooh! Interesting call. It's a very interesting call. Okay then, so I have no charge or anything. Whenever you play a card, oh. well, this is a bit of an unfortunate situation to be in. There's not really much I can do. Just take out this mana addict. Uh, very annoying card, especially with the combos. Uh, as soon as the strike into eviscerate is what four damage. Actually, I don't know if it stacks. I'm assuming it does. It's an additional four damage. Um, that's generally how I do it. As soon as the strike into eviscerate or shiv into Eviscerate, sinister strike, eviscerate. Well, you can, you can, you can do it like one after the other, so you can double eviscerate. But it, it doesn't really matter. Ooh, obviously I'm aiming for the wrong one. They, they, they have a strong minion advantage here. Ooh, until Tastingo. A wild Tastingo appears. Tastingo. Tastingo. Yeah, that's not really going to do me much good. Like that's, that's going to blast me against. Two of those three minions. Or possibly even one. He's probably got an assassinate. He can use it this turn. If he's just drawn or he previously had an assassinate, he's dead. But is it worth it for nine damage? When I could have something a lot more powerful in my hand, which is why I haven't used it. I do have a flame strikes out waiting two turns time. Flame strikes clearing that board up nicely. If I haven't lost by then. Oh, no, I have, I'm not saying I'm going to lose by then, but... That card in the end, I have a sneaking suspicion, might be an eviscerate. Very sneaking suspicion, but we, you know, we'll see. Eviscerate, it's not eviscerate, it's assassinate, that's what I meant to say. Oh, here we go, what's this? A Grobashi Berserker. Hey, that's, that's a bit of a clear as well for our side, so that's nice. The gadgets and mercenary. That auctioneer, why did I say mercenary? Um, okay, so let's get down. The raid lead? No, see, this is an odd one. Some of this Give guy. Give me a quest. We must cleanse the sunwell. There we go. That's a, that's a nice little buff to him. So he's four four. Uh, if if I were him, I would sacrifice my dark iron dwarf, dark iron 
yeah, Dark Iron Dwarf to kill the quest and adventurer. I'll never tell. However, well, I don't know why they've got that. Oh, go for this one. Good call. <gasps> Wait, what? Oh, it was comboed, yeah, okay. That was a good call. Um I could flame strike and take out all four of them. All three of them. Push forward. It's not your lucky day, Mr. Rogue. It is not your lucky day. I'm happy to clear that border. What? Give me yeah, three additional damage. Yeah. Well, actually, I shouldn't be so happy about that because you know that's that's cleared my board for a turn. Um, next turn, I could power blast him for ten, even the playing field a bit. Uh, I could summon two mental. Oh, two mirror images. That's very nice. Let's get uh, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we'll chuck down this I guy. The best deals Why? Oh, this can't that that Why did I do that? <laughs> God's sake, that was stupid. I don't know why I did that actually. Like I <laughs> just completely messed that strategy up. <laughs> Proper balls it up. Oh dear. Right. Uh oh. No, oh, that's not so bad. I can deal I can deal with this little ball off. That's uh eviscerate. Okay, so that's my my damage output for the turn gone. Sort of. Don't mess with Tusker. Oh Tusker. That's one damage to my guy. Right, okay, uh, 5, 6, 7, 8. I could just take them all out, actually. Um, is it worth summoning him first, then him? I'll see what they've got first. So if he does not have a way to board clear, I'm assuming he's probably going to have a fan of knives. He hasn't used it yet. Unless he hasn't drawn either. I'm assuming he has one or two Fan of Knives in his deck. That's just standard, isn't it? So, if he uses Fan of Knives, that's going to clear my uh, clear my mirror image off. But that, again, put knock everything down by one. But it'd feel, it feel a bit redundant, I suppose. Wasting it on something so small. Oh, okay then. No, oh, he's got summer. Ah, Reckless Rocketeer. And something else. Conceal. Okay then. So he's dealing five, six, seven damage. Uh, okay then, I can't silence these guys either, can I? Stealth. Can't be attacked or targeted until it deals damage. Okay then. Um, do ten damage at least on fourteen. That's not nowhere near enough. Handle it. I can't talk, I can't talk. It's not a valid target. So I can't. Oh, I'm not able to summon it. Yeah, okay. That's fine. Uh, yeah, yeah. So you can do five, six, seven. So you can do seven damage to me next turn, and if that is a sinister strike, it is GG. You can do eight damage to me. Sorry, five, six, seven. Yeah, eight damage. If he has a sinister strike and eviscerate, he's one. Or deadly poison. He seems to be thinking well about this. Played. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah, he's won, yeah. He's got this. Yeah, he's got a charge. Well, well played. That was a close game. That was a good one. That was literally one turn in that. It was all up to the look of that draw. He picked up his uh, Argent Charger, Argent Crusader, whichever one it was. Well, this is, this is t going terribly for an arena run. But one win, two losses. I need obviously need more experience before I should start doing this. I'm not going to get nowhere near enough uh, coins after doing this as well to do it again. So, hope I need to win this one now. I need to prop put my back into it and win. Oh, we're looking a penniless paladin. Everyone loves a penniless paladin. Jaina versus Valera. Right, another rogue. Again, happy with rogues. I know what rogues do. So. I could I could deal with a rogue. Let's get rid of this one. Uh, we don't want a flame strike so early on. 
Cut a call, that's a bit better, a bit more use. Got the coin again. It's giving me this advantage. It wants me to win. I got flame strike anyway. <laughs> God's sake. Go on, we'll give you your arcane. Take those three damage. Take that nice three damage there. Yeah, he had that coming. Ooh, it's fallen. Are you gonna go? You're out. Burn. Very good card. Again, jealous I didn't get that on the draw. Can't be targeted by spells or hero powers. I don't want to waste anything yet, I'm happy to take three damage in the sac in sacrifice in order to bring something a bit better out. Next turn I'll bring out this guy. Let the pain speak to me. A yes. They cannot take him down without, any, without extra assistance. I'm assuming he's probably got Shiv. Maybe I'll see again. I'm making a lot of assumptions. Head crack is also very good. Uh, but most people will not use head crack without a combo because it's up. Oh, this could, how lucky is he gonna get? Oh, too lucky apparently. Irritating, infuriatingly irritating. Now this guy here. See, whenever this minion takes damage, draw a card. So this one, this one could be difficult. Oh, in fact, I could summon that first. Right, I'm hoping for two on that one. Uh, after this, actually, it doesn't even matter. Oh, I did it the wrong way around. Did it the wrong way around. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm an idiot. I could have had two damage on that guy for absolutely nothing, and I didn't do it. See, this is why I've lost two games. <laughs> I had it coming. If I'm pl going to continue yeah, playing like this, you know. Ooh, Venticore, Ver Venticore Mercenary. A very st strong and... Not so strong card. Very good time to clear the board, however. Minions costing two additional. Uh, that's not only on his side, isn't it? Yeah. So his minions are costing two additional. Um, and mine are not, so. Uh, he's not doing any damage with that for one turn, which I'm completely happy with. Uh, he's completely wasted his thing, really. He could be doing seven damage next turn instead. Uh, I'll actually just waste it if I can't call. Ooh! Shiv. Again. I said that. Very nice card. The damage is pretty consistent from this rogue though, which is which is good on his part. Very nice. Uh, get the Scarlet Crusader out this turn. Two mirror images. Uh, yeah, that's good. So. For the crusade. Happy with that. Talk, knock him down to three. Uh, my turn. Knock him out with the uh, Scarlet Crusader. That worked out quite nicely for me, actually. Unless he's got one of those uh, pandas. Eviscerate. Well, I'm not sure why he started his turn with that one. Oh, okay, then. Very nice. I can see why he started his turn with that now. Join or die. <laughs> Right, it's my turn on the offensive. I'm quite behind on damage here. Well, quite behind, I'm very behind on damage here. I have no minions left in my hand. This is a very, very bad position to be in. That's a good card as well. That is also a good card. This is a very bad position to be in. Right, we can seven... Victory or death! Right, another board clear. Unfortunately, we had to waste a flame strike on that. It, it, we, it, it couldn't. It could be worse, I suppose. Uh, backstab, two damage, two damage minion. He's just going to attack it once. Yeah. Uh, and then he may have something else in his hand that can even it out for him. Out, out. Yes, draw seven cards. Good card that one. I barely ever see it used though. Not as much as it should be, obviously, for a card that strong. You shall not pass. It's the best we can do for now. We've got another taunt up, which should block at least a turn of damage. 
Unless he has an assassinate, which I highly doubt he's going to blow it on that. He must assume that this card in my hand is either a spell or a high level minion that I can't summon yet. And if I can't summon it yet, it means it's a 10, which is pretty scary. So you'd be saving your assassinate for that. Oh, this is how I would be thinking anyway. You'd keep your uh, your assassinate for the ten minions or anything or anything quick like around that. Ooh, Assassin's Blade, good card. Deadly poison. That's my uh, double deadly poison. Seven damage. This is looking pretty scary right about now. Do you need a blessing? What? Yeah, this is looking very scary right now. I'm not sure I like where this is going, truthfully. So you can deal 7 damage to me. Uh, oh, I, I, I'm bored by this. Sorry, man. Remember, kill for loss. Right, he's on 9. Two turns, I am dead. Well, he deals 7 damage to me, I have 4 left. 5 left, even. God, I can't count today. You gotta be kidding me! Right, that's a disadvantage to him, on the upside. Well, I'm dead next turn if I can't do 9 damage, let's go. Pyroblast. Oh, damn it! Wait, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, no! As if. I don't have a spell either. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I got the best deals anywhere! Well played. Remember, kill for luck! I can't believe it. I can't believe no it. <laughs> it's one health in it. Oh god. Oh dear. <laughs> oh, that makes it fine though. You know, the arena runs literally down to one health. Well played, Mr. Rogue. Well played. Oh. Hey, it leveled me up my it leveled up my mage a few ranks. That that's all that matters, I suppose. Let's have a look what we gained from this absolutely abysmal arena run then. Because that was an abysmal arena run. Come on then, what we got? Yay, boxes. Whoa, five, five, woo, five gold, five gold. A booster pack, woo, ten gold. It's a nice twenty gold to add to my add to my forty gold though. Oh, right, let's do a pack opening as well. Why not? We'll do that while we're here. <laughs> got, to, got to end the game on a high after all. Come on then, we want three legendaries. All right, that's a rare. That's a rare. So that's two rares. So we'll do these ones first. Fen Creeper, Rampage, and Frost Elemental. Relatively decent cards. Rare. We've got a uh, Young Priestess. Very good card. Very, very good card. I don't think I even have any of them yet. Rare. And a uh, Ravenholt Assassin, which is a, a decent-ish card. It's, it's pretty good. It's good when you first play it, because it can't be taken out the turn you play it. She's nice. Right, yeah. We'll, uh, we'll leave it there then after... A very disappointing end to a very quick arena run.